hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel welcome if you are new um so today's video is an extremely exciting one we're getting our christmas decorations so if you are new me and greg moved into our first house this year um it's a new build tape by tape and pizza free bed um semi um and we're currently in the middle of doing our um living room transformation i'm gonna say, i'm gonna give you a very little sneak peek are you ready oh that's all you're getting that's all you're getting but today we are going to go and buy i need to like not get the shot not get that in the background um i need to go and get um christmas decorations so um we're changing our color scheme this year i've usually normally gone for a pink and like silver color but this time i'm going for a gold and Red, let's live. She's here. Um, I've got my Christmas tree, which is just here. Um, I actually went for a one from the White Company. It's a six foot, like really lovely looking, real looking tree. So that's my tree, but we're going red and gold this year. So I need to get all new baubles. So that's what we're doing today. So I'm gonna get some like wreaths and like, some really nice decorations. So yeah, uh, I thought I'd take you along with me and yeah. Hope you guys enjoy. Stop everyone. We have a ditch. Greg, Greg's trying to park the car. We have now coming in. Oh my god, look at all the trees and decorations. Wow. Guys, we've done, we've done quite well really. I had to, I did have to steal some off the um display. Hello everyone. So oh, I'm gonna let's <laughs> just talk about a new fruit shack. Um so I know we very very quickly went to Home Sense. We got a big bag. The rain, I'll show you. Oh yes, the range, thanks Liv. Um, put that in the bag, and now we're at a garden centre, which I think, I do love a garden centre, do you love? Do you live? Mm -hmm. I do, I love a garden centre, it's absolutely rammed in here. Greg, do you like a garden centre? I do like it, you know I like a garden centre. Oh, let's both there. Well, I was going to go a bit closer. Oh, were you? Okay. Yeah, that's not really space. But um, I want to get some more, like, I want to get like ribbon. Oh, that's a good space there. There we go. I want to get some food as well, so um, yeah, we will obviously, I'll vlog more here, I promise. Elle has found the premium decorations. Yeah, I love them. So nice. What am I doing? Showing them the, the gongs. gongs. Look at them. Oh, I love them. I'm obsessed with them. They're everywhere. But Elle's not going to buy one. No, no. Look at that. It's like, next year. How gorgeous is that? How much is it? Oh, is it light up? 42 pounds. That's quite, quite a lot, Elle. Isn't it? For like a little. Mm. That is very nice. Guys, honestly, we're in heaven. There's so much sparkle. Well, to love it all. I need. Oh, that's a nice star. I want a gold one though, don't I? <gasps> that angel's very nice. She's also very expensive, but very nice. Oh look, she's a, a jingle bell. Nice. We've got some very lovely decorations here. I am going to spend a small fortune, but it's fine. Oh, the barbecues. We actually have a house now. Looking at these, that's nice, isn't it? Seasonal clearance. I want a weather one. I Very nice. That has a smoker. Okay, yeah, definitely. So, guys, we've just popped into a cafe to get some lunch because we're all starving. Live with her milkshake. I've got um, a chicken, a mozzarella, and pesto panini. So as live, and then you've got the croc monsieur, which looks really nice actually. It does look like a bit of ham and cheese. It does, doesn't it? But we'll see. We'll see. Yeah. Hey everyone channel even though this is carrying on from a video which i'm not gonna lie everyone it's been a hot minute since i picked up this what camera we went to the garden center okay yeah so we're still in a very festive mood everyone i'm wearing this very cute little white outfit um and yes um i'm sorry i'm a bad vlogger i didn't even know how this video even started so i'm gonna have to just go back and look because i really don't know but what i will tell you is we're going to Cheltenham. We, this morning we've picked up paint to finish the lounge. It's still not complete, but it's getting there. It'll be done this week. It'll be done this week. We'll hang in the mirrors and it will all be, yeah, getting there. Um, we're not hanging in the mirrors. Are we not? No, because we need to get the sideboards first. Why do we need to get that? No, we're hanging the, we're hanging the mirrors, hun. No, because what if when you get the sideboards, you don't like the look of them where they are? You, have, you can't do that. Why not? You need the furniture in place first. I'll just measure where the furniture goes well, to. Great, I'm doing that, dude. Because I've bought my decorations to go on the mirrors for Christmas. So we're in Chatham currently, um, just doing a spot of Christmas shopping because I very have little time. Yeah, come on. 
when I'm not working now, so nice little cut in there. Um, so yeah, I thought I'd bring you along with us. Um, yeah, that's basically it. I'm gonna put the camera down now. I don't care about the scene. I don't care. So we're being to a white company for our annual Christmas trip. I have trip. just I've just shopped without looking at price tags and I would not recommend again. And now we have found like the nicest smelling place. Looks absolutely amazing. Like guys, if you could smell, if we could pass the smell on through the camera. It honestly smells amazing, like absolutely amazing. We couldn't not get one. No, we'll show you out in a minute. It's a gear off. Oh Look God. at it. Oh, it's not going to focus. Halloumi. Oh, go on out. How is it? <laughs> mm. So good. All right, I'm going to leave you guys because I really want to eat it now. Just had that gear off. It was absolutely amazing. Um, we are getting a Starbucks now. First ever um, festive Starbucks. Getting an eggnog latte. Huh? Your first ever. First one this year. Sorry, yeah. Wrong wording, but yeah. First ever Christmas Starbucks. And um, we're going to John Lewis to look at some wreath. What are we doing now? I've just bought a wreath, guys. We're going to put it when we get back. And we're just buying. Elle's surprise Christmas present. Not so surprise. He, Greg's been saying he can buy these for literally three years. And I'm finally, he's finally buying them for me. Lucky girl. Yeah. Hi guys, so back in the car now, as you can see on the way back home, I'm absolutely pooped. And my foundation, my lipstick gone as well. Oh, can I have lipstick for Christmas? No, I don't really like getting you makeup for presents. Okay. That's fine. Um, I can't wait to show you what we've got. I can't show you all the decorations we got, but I haven't shown you any for the um, Christmas tree yet. I bought some um, branches for the Christmas tree that I really wanted, been looking for, and I literally found the most perfect ones. Greg absolutely hates them, but it's fine, because I don't care, because it's the tree, and I've spent some more fortune on the tree and the decorations, so. Guys, the tree doesn't even have fake snow on it. I'm living. Oh, Bubby. If you want to get some fake spray no, cans, because then you can wipe it off. Not the same. Oh, yeah, because I'm going to wipe the tree down at the end of the day. Exactly. Um, but um, I treated myself to a little um, perfume um, from, not perfume, yeah, perfume from um, Tom Ford. One thing you have got the job doing is putting the reef up. Should I Google how to put a reef up? Does, does anyone reef know how to put a reef up? Do you? Why did we get off from John Lewis then? Reef hanger. Yeah, one of them. Yeah. Well, no, you don't want that. You want like a gold one. No, you don't. Home base, two pounds. You don't scratch them. Yeah, but can't you put some? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That 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 felt you got. Yeah. I was gonna put that on the back of it. That's what I thought. Is that what you already thought? Oh, <gasps> that one's nice. Next, black star Christmas wreath holder. John you know might text Liv and say, Liv, will you go and get this for me? Is that really cheeky? Yeah. It is, isn't That's it? But I think cheeky. I think you should actually go and do it for me, in all fairness. Should I text her? I'm gonna text Liv and see because she's coming around. I'm gonna text her so I can get away with her going to get me a refund. I'm gonna see if it's in stock and we can pick it up on the way back. Oh, I can do click and collect and give her the code. Ah, oh, yes. Right, bear with me, guys. I'll give you an update with Liv managed to get us so one. Cool. Update, everyone. I've just ordered a wreath hanger from Next. It was twelve pounds. Quite expensive, really, but it's got a cute little. Yeah, I know, but it's gonna be longer to come. It's all the better quality as well, and it will put the little belt thing on the door. But um, Liv did say she'd go and get it for me, but I've said to her, "Don't worry, we'll have to go and get it together because I have to wait an hour for them to text me the collection number." So um, I'd probably be best just going into the shop and buy one. But hopefully they'll text me within the hour so I can go and get it. But that's, that was the update. Um, I'll show you the one I ordered. It's really cute, actually. It's this one. Pat. My mum from having a I know, do you know what? I always think of that when I see a reef on a door, I'm thinking of Nick putting it like that. My dad's door, so. Yeah, like so he, he that's the one we've it. got. But he always says, I'm oh, nice. But he's like, It's oh, cute, isn't it? Reefs scratch doors. Yeah, so basically, I'd already thought about it because I remember your dad literally telling me that they re reef scratch doors. So the Greg got some felt bottoms, like little um, sticky things for our table, chairs, and my chair upstairs. So I've already thought we can stick those to the back of it so it's felt on the door. Oh, I've got a fake tan, just ignore that. Um, what was I saying? Felt. Felt on the back of the door so that 
the tractor door. And he'll be impressed, won't he? Probably. But you know, that's the plan. I'm cooking roast tonight. I don't think I haven't told you that yet. I'm cooking roast for my mum and dad. They're coming round in about an hour and a half. Um, so I'm really excited to cook at the, cook at the full blown fake. Cooking. Huh? Yeah, MS are cooking the roast. Well, I'm, you're cooking it. I'm cooking it. I'm cooking it. They provided. They prepped and provided it. So yeah, um, that's what we're doing. And um, well, I'm going to the gym. Grace going to the gym. And then England. Oh yeah, England are playing. Is it coming home? I am a bit of a fortune teller. Are you? Mm. Never heard this before. So I do believe. Bit of a side hustle, is it? I believe it's not coming home. Well, Sorry. shock, negative. I just don't think it's coming home. Brilliant. Unfortunately. Ruin my day. If it does, I mean, part of me does think. I think potentially, it will now I think that you're not actually a fortune teller. And you've <laughs> just made that up. Well, you. If I was going to say yes, you were going to say, oh yes, lovely, you're a fortune teller. Oh no, I probably would have had the opposite. Oh, I'm so tired. Also, do you like my um, blue nails? I know they're really outgrown now. Liv did them for me. They're so gorgeous. She's so good, bless her. She's um, going to be opening up her own nail business. I think they're really cute. Little blue nails for Christmas. I'm going to get some red next time, I think. Can I have red nails next time? Mm -hmm. You still haven't had baby blue nails. Yeah, I'll get them in the spring. It's not, it's not that, it's not that time of year at the moment, but um, yeah. I'll catch you guys on my home. Guys, this is the garland I picked up in John Lewis. It's like a champagne-y colour. I absolutely love it. And we're going to put it on the front door now. So, let's just shut that. It's not going to lock us out, is it? No. Oh, I need to keep it open, don't I? Haha. <laughs> Lol. Right, Liv, would you mind filming me putting this up? Right, go on then. So, the wreath I got has a star on it. Okay, ready? Oh, yes. Okay. That's cute, isn't it? That looks so nice. Let's give it a close. Yes. Does not look cute. It looks nice. Oh my god. Oh, I absolutely love, love it. And the star. I think the star looks nice on it as well. But actually, I'm really happy with that. Really happy. Love it. Christmas. Everyone, so you are going to have to ignore the football in the background because my boyfriend currently sat there watching the football, which is just up there. They're so, not house. Greg. Greg is watching the football. But I want to show you what I've collected over the last few weeks for the Christmas tree before obviously it goes up in the next video. So, um, I have gone a bit OTT, guys. Today, definitely gone a bit OTT, OTT but it happens, it happens. Elf has made a very successful roast. Oh, yeah, we just had the roast, guys. I didn't film it all because I just wanted to see my mum and dad. But um, honestly, I'll put a little video in now. But yeah, we're really happy. My mum made the gravy and whew, it was a good roast. So yeah, anyway, so I bought these. <laughs> and when you're shopping in a quite an expensive place, I do not recommend buying something without looking at the price tag because the price tag was gone. I thought, well, how much is the Christmas decoration gonna be? These are said decorations. They are adorable. I got three. They were 10 pounds each. Sorry. Sorry, I almost had a heart attack at the till because I got quite a lot more. The figure she said, I was like, oh. Luckily, I had 15% off. Don't know quite what I, what I would have done otherwise. Had 15% off. It still wasn't great. I was like, oh, okay, that's fine. So, we've got three of these to go on the tree, which I think are really adorable. They're from the white company. If you. If I didn't tell you already. Sorry if I didn't. So, I got three of those. I also picked up i honestly don't know why i did it to myself because this was extortionate as well i got um these merry christmas tags from the white company they were six pounds but and then i also got um this um silver ribbon for the presents going under the tree 15 pounds i'm sorry i'm sorry that's like 50 quid just there in like oh don't even go there anyway so then going on to my next bag i then obviously got a wreath that you saw earlier that was from john lewis it was 32 pounds in the sale which is fantastic i then also got from john lewis this i'm not going to get it out fully just because it's a little bit of a nightmare but i got this tree like wreath stuff it's like um 
it's like a champagne it looks probably quite um silver on camera but it's like a champagne color and it's just to like add a little bit of extra to the tree so um it's actually garlands but um i'm gonna cut them into two and basically then um put that in the tree it's all this here which i've just got glitter all over me don't know why i thought that was a good idea but obviously i did um so then what else i've got was i then got a lot of stuff from the rain so i got these two small bauble things they are the there's 14 three centimeter bubbles so these are really good for like the top of the tree when it goes a little bit thinner and just little bits and bobs over the tree um i'm going to show you what i got from the range so i've got if you guys have been around for a while you know i love ribbon in a tree so i've got gold and red ribbon i believe where's my red ribbon where's my red ribbon oh is it not oh it's in this bag Where's my red ribbon? Red ribbon. Come on. There it is. So I got a red ribbon and a gold ribbon just because um I'm going for a red and gold um colour scheme if I haven't already said in this video, which I probably already have, but yeah. Um so I've got two gold, one red, and that is a lot lighter, but obviously that's just rolled up, so it's a lot like uh, more opaque than that. Opaque, that's not the right word clear whatsoever clear transparent. transparent it's not more transparent than that i then got from the range some ball some really lovely ball balls so um this is one with the little and that was three pounds i think i don't actually know and then i got three packs of these just plain like champagne and red um ball balls just as good like fillers and then my like special ball balls which are the ones like this so that's a really gorgeous one so good it's like little stars and stuff and then i've also got some red ones like so little they've again got little decorations on lovely um i then also got some of these because greg absolutely loves his bell decoration so we had these exact um actually they were bigger so i'm quite like, i'm quite like the fact they're small but we had a um, pink glittery um not glittery bell hearts in our tree la hearts stars in our tree last year and obviously when i got rid of all the pink decorations that was one thing greg was really upset about the bells were going so i'm so gla glad that we managed to find red these are from john lewis actually they were six bloody hell greg they were six pound each I really have gone on a rampage today, guys. Um, but yeah, I got three of those. And then um, from the garden centre, I got these candy canes. I thought they were really cute. It was, um, how many are there? Two, four, six, eight, ten. Twelve candy canes for six, seven pound, which in the grand scheme of things is actually a really good value now that I've been everywhere and got every other decoration under the sun. Um, then, my local... Um, uh my local garden centre i got these decorations so they're um they've got like a um i think the idea is is that these stick around in the little things but i don't think it's quite worked out how they would want it to but there's a little gold things it's just a nice gold clear uh ball ball which i've got also a few of those i don't think these are from the rage or no these are from the garden centre little pi gold pine cones which you just wrap this bit around the tree so it's a bit different because i don't like having just ball balls on the tree i like mixing up a little bit so i got three of those so this year i don't know what has come over me but i'm absolutely obsessed with gonks and i got this little china little gonk decoration i think he's actually the cutest thing like i'm sorry he's so cute my little gonk um what should we call him bird um know me know me i like that know me huh gordon. gordon the gnome gong gong gordon the gong oh yes that's another one of those ones it's another gorgeous one so it's another clear with um white and gold <laughs> how cute is that so lovely oh another not red one oh that's gorgeous oh my god i love that i'm acting like i've never seen it before 
Look at that though, with the little Christmas decorations on. So that's a red one with a bit of gold on. Again, lovely. Uh, what else have we got? I'm hoping all these are gold now. Oh, no, that's another one of the other ones. No, that's another one. I haven't got that many red baubles, have I? Why keep asking for more? What? And you would tell me no red ones. Looks like we're going to um... There are some nice ones in John Lewis today or something like that. For some reason I thought I had more. More red. I mean I have got quite a few red in here bub. Like with these baubles. They're just not nice ones. Boring red ones. Boring red one. I'm sorry, Greg. I'm so sorry. Oh yeah, and then I have got some more white company ones so I ordered online, which are here. These were less extortionate than the other ones, but they were still quite extortionate. So, as you guys know, we'll be, we're going to be putting the mirrors up here um, once we're finished with the. Um, well, once painting been done, we're going for. I think it's this colour here. This one, this one. I think it's that one. Um, but these are the decorations from the white company. These are absolutely gorgeous. I actually love them. Greg hasn't seen these yet. We saw them in the store today. But how gorgeous is that? It's like gold and silver glitter. And I got three of those little snowflakes. I thought they're really, really cute. So, yeah, no. Christmas decorations are expensive. But I don't plan on buying hardly any next year. Um, and then I've also driven on my camera very rudely. God, that's a bit dramatic, isn't it? Bloody hell, camera. Stupid tripod. Greg, can I have a new tripod for Christmas, please? Good, okay. That's what we're saying. So, when we get the black framed mirrors, I thought this would look just so gorgeous. It's a star, a black star, with this little twine star and a bit of like a fake mistletoe. And I thought that hanging in the, like, over the top of each mirror, like at the very top, just kind of hung over like that. Do you know what I mean? The vibe. I thought that's quite just a little subtle um, decoration that would look really, really nice. So they were from the white company as well. I believe those were twelve pounds, which I think is completely worth it for that actually. Because it's like a not it's not a tree decoration. It's more of like a home decoration if you like. Um, but yeah, those are all the things I got um, for the tree. And then other things I got today were just things from me. So I think I was telling you in the car, but. I also picked up this little gift set for one of my colleagues at work. It's the Lime, Diamond Bay gift set. And then I also bought myself this Tom Ford fragrance, which is this vanilla Fatal. I'm just gonna show you that. There you go. Lovely jubbly. So really, really happy I got that because I just absolutely love the scent of it. And then this is the paint we got earlier that I was telling you about. So this is the colour we're going for, Cornforth White. I'm just gonna, ooh, my legs hurt from the gym. I'm gonna probably end this extremely long video because I think it's probably gonna be one of the longest videos I've ever put up because it's been filmed over such a long time. Um, but in this video, I think you've pretty much seen fire, Christmas decorations. What's that noise, you? Not sure. Was it? Um, but yeah, no, so this is the last time you'll see it unpainted. And next well, time. Is this a fire? Fire's not in this one. It is, yeah. I thought fire was part two. It's just a vlog without the fire. Oh, yes. Okay, you haven't seen the fire then. Oh, I don't want to show them that then, do I? No, no I do. No, I don't. No. Oh, no. I've just filmed a whole entire se segment in front of the fire. Hmm. Do you know what? If you've got this far into the video, you got a sneak peek. Special. So comment down below if you got to see a sneak peek of the video or message me on Instagram. And you are one of the elite who got through this very random and bloody all over the place vlog. But thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you in my next video. Which, which is the fire. Which is the fire. Anyway, love you guys. Bye.